After Far Glory Land Development Chairman Zhao Tengxiong pleaded guilty to all charges in two bribery cases on Thursday, prosecutors call him in for another round of questioning today. Zhao has been accused of bribing officials to expedite public housing projects in New Taipei City's Linko District and Taoyuan's Bade District last year. However, Zhao surprised many today by admitting to bribery in a Xinju City Veterans Village project, even though a district court had handed down an innocent verdict in the same case. When questioned by reporters today, Zhao refused to answer. Observers speculate Zhao has admitted to bribery in the Linkol, Bade and Xinju development cases in hopes of obtaining a more lenient sentence. My guess is that in the extra hearing on Thursday in the High Court, the judge seemed like he would deliver a guilty verdict, so he may have offered a guilty plea in exchange for preferential treatment. A Far Glory spokesman said that during a Shinju City Veterans Village repurposing project, Zhao had dined with government officials in hopes of receiving their assistance. He later felt that the actions he had taken were wrong, but this did not amount to an outright confession of guilt. If he is simply saying that he should not have eaten a meal, I do not think this constitutes an outright confession on corruption, and there should not be a question of whether he should get a lighter sentence. In the first ruling handed down by a lower court, Zhao was sentenced to four and a half years imprisonment. The case is currently ongoing in the Taiwan High Court.